they know that you did the best you can. That, that's all the Lord is asking. Everybody ain't going to be able to get no A, B, or even a C. You know, everybody might not even be able to pass. But you got to put in the effort. You have to put in the effort, man. The Lord ain't going to give you nothing more than you can handle. So whatever, matter of fact, everybody will be able to pass because the Lord ain't going to make the test to like you harder. He ain't going to make it harder than what you can't handle. If, if, if I clear yeah, that up, go ahead. No, no, I was about to say, you, you're going to be able to pass it, man. Exactly. You, you know, you just got to tough it, man it up. Gird, gird, gird up, up that I will require that. I'm almost done. Slot. Yeah. So a couple more, bro. I'm almost done. I'm going to wrap it up. Um, Verse 14, for we know that the law is spiritual, but I am carnal, so unto sin. For that which I do, I allow not. For what I would, that I do not. But, but what I hate, that I do. If then I do that which I would not, I consent unto the law that is good. Now then, it is no more, that I, it is no more I that do it, but sin that dwelleth in me. For I know that in me that is in my flesh dwelleth no good thing. So and you, once you're in this flesh, you can't say you're righteous. You can't say you, you can't. you're a piece of shit and you're a liar. Okay? Because there's no good thing in this flesh, man. Facts. You know? Everlasting change of darkness. That's why Paul kept saying, fight the good fight. It's a fight. The spirit is indeed willing, but the flesh is not. It's a constant war, a constant struggle. So it says, for I know that in me that is in my flesh dwelleth no good thing. For, for to... For to will is present with me, but how to perform that which is good I find not. For the good that I would do not, but the evil which I would not, that I do. Mm. Now if I do that what now if I do that I would not, it is no more I that do it, but sin that dwelleth in me. I find I find then a law that when I would do good, evil is present with me. For I delight in the law of Yahweh after the inward man, but I see another law in my members, warring against the law of my mind. Like I like I did the video that the chick asked me how do I rebuke the demon with the scriptures, man. It's it's, un, it's in your mind half the yeah, damn time. Even. You could be reading the scripture and a damn demon will just pop, a wicked ass thought will just pop out of nowhere. Bro, it's weird as hell. It's, well, it ain't yeah, weird. No, no, that Dude, should be weird. It'd be Dude, where weird. Where that came from? <laughs> that should be weird because you're like, what the fuck? Like, yeah, I ain't even... I'm trying to do be the spirit, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fucking pup, pussy ass flesh, flesh hey, body, hi. man. It says, um, uh, but it's verse 23. But I see another law in my members warring against the law of my mind and bringing me into captivity <laughs> to the law of sin which is in my members. Oh, wretched man that I am. Like, again, we all pieces of shit, man. You know, we all pieces of shit. And this is our reasonable service. This is the least we could do. This is how we get that dirt off, man. You know, by hey. doing this work, by being obedient. Cleansing ourselves with Praying that hyssop, man. Hey, con the hyssop, man. Praying to the Lord, begging that broken contrite. That pleases the Lord, man. It pleases the Lord to bruise him. Yeah, the Lord love it, man. It says, O wretched man that I am, and who, who shall deliver me from the body of this death? I thank Yahweh through Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, our Lord, so then with the mind I myself serve the law of Yahweh, but with the flesh the law of sin. Mm -hmm. That's it. And that, that's beautiful. I never actually thought about that. You got two, two sets of people, those who serve the flesh, the flesh and the devil with their own mind. Yeah. They live in Esau's world. They, they're living in both. They, they hold body and soul given to corruption. We find a good fight. Kind you, know? Of, kind you know, even though we have the same weak flesh today, they got, we, yep. we find mentally, we find that the spiritual fight. So that, that's beautiful. Yep, that's exactly. You hit it on the head. Like hit I said, the man, they, they, they like fucking they make beach that. balls in the ocean. Whichever the way the waves toss them, whatever they feel, whatever feels good, they do. Because like we all know, we know the scripture. We all, we, to we, the average Christian know the scripture. Broad is the way that leads to destruction. They all know it. Most they know majority of the shit is wickedness, man. But you, you got to fight that fight in your mind, man. Yeah. You got to. We all have what 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 my trigger may be may not be. My trigger may be fat asses, man. Mm -hmm. I may have a thing for fat asses. You might big titties or something. I don't know. Yeah, exactly. You might like shrimp. I don't. You might like pork. I don't know. <laughs> you know. 
Hey. You might have hey. another man's butt. Oh, I don't know. Nah, hey, <laughs> hey, but, hey, the white hey, house watching me outside. But everybody, for that's beer. Yeah, the white house, that's a hell of a deal. That's a hell of a deal. But every person got a different um, crop, but that's your cross to bear, man. And it's nothing compared to the demons that was on that was thrown on the house shot, man. Bro, and and, 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 that, and that's crazy. Even if that is the spirit that's on you, where you you got a thing for people of the same sex, the Lord don't give you no more than you can bear. So if you really turned to the most high and came back into your heritage, heritage man, you could you could fight that, man. But yeah, that, the Paul did say uh, some of you were, uh, you know, um, what do you call them? I forget it. But Paul spoke about that, that some of them were, were homosexuals, man. I forget the exact scripture. I know, I know what you're talking about. I know so what It is going to be, you know, you can repent. The, you know, the only sin you can't re repent from is blasphemy. Or the Holy Spirit, you know? and I don't think you, hey, and cutting off your member. Oh, but you can still dig them. Them sodomites gonna make it, man. In the kingdom, <laughs> they're gonna be in the kingdom, man. They're gonna be all right. He saw, face he, judgment. Yeah, they're gonna face judgment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's yeah. what I meant. That's what I meant. But, but um, they're gonna face death by pain. But he saw he was the only one that uh, blasphemed the Holy Scriptures, you know, by saying he's the Lord, painting his image, Con. as a likeness. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I got uh, two free so speaking on um, sin. We didn't even go. I had I had a whole. I, had, I see how Elder Apostle Harfield. I had a whole <laughs> bunch of scriptures <laughs> lined up. We didn't even hit none of these scriptures, man. But that was a spirit to hey, How much time we got? I didn't know that I gonna cut off some. I got uh, a. Right, Genesis chapter four it says, "If thou dost well, shalt thou not be accepted." So this was a Yahweh mm, talking to Cain. Beautiful. Yep. Mm. Yep. Now, my mind was, I was going, that was, I was, might have was going, going, going to go into that too earlier. I was like, should go into that. Fugitive in the vagabond. Fugitive in the vagabond. <laughs> I was, I to, that was my spirit too. That's beautiful. Hey, it always come around full circle. If not, I'm going to get on Esau. Bang on him a little bit. <laughs> Rough his ass up. Yeah. Rough his feathers. If the, oh, if, man. If thou dost well, shalt thou not be accepted? Hey, that's the same thing with us, man. The Lord is not unjust, man. He's a just power. The just power, man. You do what you're supposed to do. The Lord is going to fight for you, man. You and, know. And just like he was saying, you know, we we doing our best. We out here trying to teach. We out here trying to edify others and, and be a family for Yahweh. Shah. If thou doest not well, sin lies at the door. So we are speaking on sin, and we know this: that sin is, is everywhere. You you can, you can always find something wicked to do, but to do good, like your brother said, you know, it, it's it's hard, but it's not impossible. We strive we strive towards the mark. And, it said, and unto thee shall be his desire, and thou shalt rule over him. So if, if we fall into sin, man, you you, you can become reprobate. The, the Bible says uh, the spirit does not dwell in a malicious soul. Wisdom does not dwell in a... The word reprobate means void of judgment. So you lack judgment, man. That's what the breath you exact. <laughs> that's man, it right there. Get there bro. You, you lack judgment, man. That's why they, they mm. give... What you said it? What it said it? Right there? That's the precept? Yeah. If thou dost well, shalt thou not be accepted. If thou dost not well, sin lies at the door. That's you, you lust, man. Your lust is it's, it's at the door. We're in the flesh, man. You best believe yeah. it's some wickedness you, you can get into. We all know it's some shit we'll take pleasure in, man. We could even do some wickedness right now. Facts. But we, we, we fighting against that. We warring against the flesh, man. We, I, we trying to stay in the spirit, trying to please you. How about was shy? But if you want, sin lies at the door. It's ready to go whenever you want, man. It's some wicked ass. Website you can go on, some wicked ass dating app or something. It's you know? so accessible. It's, it's man. some woman that's married you can go pop willingly, gladly. Yeah. It's some wicked that you can get into easily. Easily. You know? I got, and this is speaking on sin. I, I never knew how bad it was until I moved to uh, yeah, Taiwan. It had all these these, these uh, massage shops and all this crazy stuff. And I'm, I'm, I'm not from the city, so I'm seeing all this wickedness. And I'm like, damn, I thank the most high that I didn't get caught up in that. But I would see, you know, some other Americans. You know, going there just to go have their little fun, you know? They go with a lot of them Edomites, them old Edomite, rich, middle class, you know, rich Edomites go over there to fuck little boys, you know, little trannies and shit. Damn demons, man. Thailand, uh, they showed you that in, um, what's that, uh, Knocked Up? Not Knocked Up, uh, Hangover? Was it Hangover? The hangover? Yeah, they showed, they went over there to Thailand and there was a bunch of trannies and oh, shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I got one more, one more free stuff. <clears throat> this is Ecclesiastes chapter 21 verse 1 my son Ecclesiastes chapter 21 verse 1 my son has thou sinned 
do so no more, but ask pardon for thy sins. That's what Jehovah Shai kept saying, man. Anytime he would heal somebody, he would say what? Sin no more, man. He'd heal you, but then he'd say, go thy way and sin, sin no, no more. more. And he say, go keep doing what the hell you was doing. You know? Go ahead, Ock. Uh, flee from sin as from the face of a serpent. Oh, haul ass, man. Haul, I know I don't like serpents. I hate snakes. I'm a haul ass, bro. Flee. <laughs> hey, Esau loves snakes, man. They're wicked. They love snakes and have them with packs and shit. <laughs> you know? For if thou comest too near it, it will bite thee. The teeth, therefore, are as the teeth of a lion slaying the soul of man. All iniquity is as a two-edged sword. The wounds, therefore, cannot be healed. So we, we run from that sin because you see people, they say a little bit of love and love the whole lot. You know, and you see somebody start wilding out. Next thing you know, they gone. They, they, they just caught up in their sin and you can't barely get to, get to them anymore. It's, it's, a, it's so crazy to me, too, man. Like like like, like Harai was saying, man, Yahushua said he healed people and said sin no more. And the crazy thing about it is, like, like what if Yahweh Shah said you were blind and he healed you and was like, okay, you're healed. But if you fall back into your wicked ways, your sight gonna start to go away. That's exactly what happened. You know yeah, what I'm saying? That's exactly what happened. Yeah, you're right. He takes the oil from you. First of all, first, it, 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 hold on. No, go ahead. Go ahead. That's, first, that's exactly what happened. If you're in this truth anyways, I'm not talking about you, anybody in the world. If you're in this truth and you, 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 you go back into the world, you return back to your vomit as the scripture said the dog returns return to, to his vomit. He gonna take the, the sight, your sight, this wisdom. The, the, we seen many, we know men that we, fell off, yeah, man. We, we experienced it. You, we taught the men, I didn't even know that scripture was, you, we, we going through the scriptures, they arguing with us about a topic on the scripture that they know. We broken down and broken down to other people. And then we pull a scripture, he like, I didn't even know that scripture. The Lord took the sight from took, him, took, took the away. oil from him, you know? Mm -hmm. The Lord will do that for, to you, man. This ain't a game, bro. He'll it, skew cold. you out. This ain't, man. It's not a game, bro. It, it, it's definitely not a game, man. It's definitely not a game. Oh, oh, that was another point. And but the, the <coughs> scriptures also tell you about that. About the that that house that was swept and cleaned. You know, did you say you had one demon on you? I'm roughly paraphrasing. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. But say you had one demon on you, right? You and come seven other. Yeah, you gotta come back with seven fortified, eight, seven more fortified demons. So say you were. Um, I don't fucking, whatever. Say you had one demon on you, and that, that was your thing in the world. When you go back, you come into the truth, the Lord take that off of you. You come, you fall out the truth again. Now you're doing that plus seven over more. Why? Because the Lord takes that head from around you, man. Perfect. So, I don't want this to cut out on us. You got to do something too? Uh, yeah, I just got, if you want, if you got I something. wanted to, I wanted to hit this, hit that point, but I, I don't want it to cut out like last time. We didn't get to close All right, out. go ahead, go ahead. I don't like, I don't like to close out, bro. How much time? Is, uh, yeah, we gonna close out here. So okay. anyway, um, yeah, I, I wanted to get this to hit that point. This is Romans, cause I always uh, this scripture is always the Lord did that to you, man. The Lord don't want some of you. He get, like the brother said, you're reprobate, you're void of judgment. But the Lord gave you over to that reprobate mind, man, cause the Lord don't want you. So this is um, get straight to the point for the sake of time. This is Romans. Uh, 1 and 24. Wherefore, Yahweh also gave them up to uncleanliness through the lust of their own hearts to dishonor their own bodies between themselves, who changed the truth of Yahweh into a lie and worshiped and served the creature more than the creator. And the brother brought out about the, the, the creature was made subject, subject to vanity. vanity. So you, the, the creature, meaning your flesh, the spirit is willing, but the flesh is not. So the Lord gave y'all up to the, to the creature, your flesh, your lust. That's why a lot of you are stuck on Snapchat. You love your, you just love this place, man. You love yourself. You just completely lovers, what is it, uh, lovers of self, you know, boasters, proud. That's, that's the majority of you people. But the Lord gave you over that to carnality. Majority of this world is carnal, man. They're not yeah. spiritual. They're all about pleasing the flesh, the body. What they see, what they taste. And that's why the Lord gave y'all this massive playground to enjoy y'all selves. Exactly. Because when the when the when the when the when the recompense comes, you, you have nothing to say. There's the no Lord gave you sin. There's no close to your sin. He gave you the rope to hang yourself. Exactly. Live it up. So it says, Wherefore Yahweh also gave them up to uncleanliness through their lust of their own hearts, to dishonor their own bodies between themselves, who changed the truth of Yahweh into a lie. And worshipped and served the Creator more than more than creature. Sake. That's what it is. And served the creature more than the Creator, who is blessed forever. Amen. 
For this cause, Yahweh gave them up unto vile affections. Mm, vile. Meaning disgusting. Super disgusting. For even their women did change. So even women on women is vile and disgusting. Because some men think that's okay, man. It's okay to have a threesome or some shit. That's vile, man. That's disgust. That's an abomination also. Abomination. All, all three of y'all supposed to be put to death. <laughs> all okay? three, my. Yeah. So it says, for this cause, Yahweh gave them up unto vile affections. For even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature. Like we brought out earlier. Nature. E Esau is completely against nature. It's common sense. Con. Everything fits. It's pleasurable. It, you can be fruitful and multiply. That's the way the Lord made it, man. Yeah. Nature shows you it. And, and it's, Bible, it's not complicated. The scripture even says that the wicked children multiply, but they multiply for the sword. For the, for the sword. Sword. For children be multiplied to be multiplied for the sword. It says, For this cause, Yahweh gave them up unto vile affections, for even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature. And likewise, also the men leave in the natural use of the woman. So it's natural to be with a woman, man. Burned in their lust. They were burning. That con What's that word? <laughs> Concupiscence. Burning, man. They're burning in their britches. They were to burning. be a damn sodomite. A demon. <laughs> <laughs> lust oh, demon. The Lord man. gave you over to that. Like I said, that's a hell of a demon. That's, the Lord it, that's gave a hell of a demon, man. And likewise, also the men leave in the natural use of the woman. Burned in their lust one toward another, mm. men with men working that which is unseemly and receiving in themselves that recompense of their error, which was meat, meaning which was good. Whatever, your punishment that you get for being a sodomite is good. And even as they did not like to retain Yahweh in their knowledge, Yahweh gave them over to a reprobate mind. So two-thirds, the Lord gave you over to whatever bugged out Whatever Crazy bugged out thoughts you, you have to. in your mind, that's what the Lord gave you over to that. Okay? And even as they did not like, because you don't want to retain your house. You don't want to seek after the Lord. You don't want to know it's pleasing unto the Lord. You want to do your own thing. They're indulging in pleasure. They're indulging in pleasure of the flesh, man. No matter, no matter what the consequences are. Yep. That's the crazy thing about it, man. Especially you sodomites, man. All type of medical problems y'all have by doing that crazy shit that y'all doing, man. And you know it ain't right, but you can't help it because that demon is on you. That there. demon. The Lord gets praise, boy. And even as they did not like to retain Yahweh in their knowledge, Yahweh gave them over to a reprobate, meaning void of judgment, reprobate mind, to do those things which are not convenient, being filled with all unrighteousness, fornication, wickedness, covetousness, maliciousness, full of envy, murder, debate, deceit, Malignity, whisperers, backbiters, haters of Yahweh, despiteful, proud, boasters, inventors of evil things, disobe disobedient to parents, without understanding, convenient, it's a covenant breakers, with, without natural affection, implacable, unmerciful, who knowing the judgment of Yahweh, that they which commit such things are worthy of death, not only do the same, but have pleasure in them that do them. Hey, that's it on that. You know, the Lord gave you over to that reprobate mind to do all that wickedness. All manner of wickedness that you guys are doing, you're going to have to pay for it. Just like Esau, Edom going to have to pay for it, you're going to have to pay for it too. So, hey, it's up to you. The tab, the tab is about due, man. Uh, as far as me and my household, we're going to serve the we're Lord. Gonna serve the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you can do whatever the hell you want to do. You know, you can eat whatever the fuck you want to eat. Fuck whoever the hell you want to fuck. Yeah. Hey, live your life, man. But you're going to have to pay that tab at the end of the day, man. And the doors of mercy are drastically closing, man. You mm. see Eagle Face Trump got the Rona. We didn't even talk about that. Eagle yeah. Face Trump got the Rona, man. Things is moving quickly. We are almost at the end of 2020, man. We're in October, what? 5th, 4th, 5th? 4th, 4th. Yeah, dude. You're almost in 2021, man. All right? Man, this is beautiful. <laughs> anyway, with that being said... Lord's one of this was edifying. We, we never get to close out. It should be cutting out, so we're going to close yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, we'll go ahead and close out, man. We're going to give all praise. I still got a little bit more fire, but we're going to close hey, out. Do a lesson. Yeah, I, yeah, I already got I got a few ready. Hey, do a lesson. Hey, You're right. Uh, with that, we're going to close out. We're going to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rakar Kodash. Again, double honors to the apostles of GMS who rule well and who taught us this truth. Shalom to all the sincere Akim out there, all the sincere Akwa. Like we always say, keep pushing, we're close. Shalom. Wa abad babar.